Hello, and welcome to our lesson on multiplying by powers of 10 using the place value table. So we're going to begin with 2.0 multiplied by 100. We have two units, zero tenths, and because we're multiplying it by 100, every digit moves to the left by two places. So the two moves into the hundreds column, the zero tenths moves into the tens column, and here we have a placeholder which moves into the units column. So 2.0 multiplied by 100 is 200. For question B, we have six units and four tenths. And because we have one zero in 10, we're moving it to the left by one place. So the six moves into the tens column and the four tenths moves into the units column. So 6.4 times 10 is 64. Do you want to try and work out questions C, D and E by pausing the video and you can resume it when you're ready. For question C, we have nine units, four tenths and eight hundredths. And we're moving every number to the left by two places because of the two zeros. So we have 948. For question D, 0.48. Every digit moves to the left by three places. So we have zero in the thousands, four in the hundreds, and the eight in the tens. And here we have a placeholder which moves into the units. So this is 480. And for question E, 3.051, multiplying it by 10. So we move one place to the left. So it becomes 30. 0.51. Okay, let's try some more questions. So do you want to try and arrange these calculations in ascending order, which means from smallest to biggest, by pausing the video and you can resume it when you're ready. Okay, so we have 0 0.524. We're multiplying it by 10, so we move one place, so it becomes 5.24. Then we have 5.24 multiplied by 100. So we move to the left two places and we have 524. For our next question, 0 0.0524, moving it to the left by three places because we're multiplying it by a thousand and this becomes 52.4. And finally, 52. 0.4 multiplied by 10 becomes 524. So in ascending order, we have the lowest value followed by 52.4 and the next two are equal. Okay, thank you for watching and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.